Yo, what's going on, everybody? What's up, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. Hey, man, I'm your host, The Wolf of Crypto. That's right. Another video here. <laughs> Another video on that Solana airdrop season, of course. Uh, like I said, when it comes to the airdrops right now, not just in general, um, but in this moment as the crypto space is doing well, right? Um, you guys been watching the market, but another platform, another DeFi platform, liquid staking. Um, again, this is another platform. I won't go into heavy detail. Just want to give a quick overview for those that want to participate in the airdrop again. Um, this is a Solana airdrop, so obviously you need a Solana wallet, right? Um, any Solana killable wallet will get you into the airdrop, but Without further ado, right, let's kind of let's dive in here today on Marinade. This is another DeFi protocol. You can provide liquidity, um, liquid staking, which is a term that probably has become my best friend in the last maybe week or two since I've been doing a little bit more research on what exactly that is. And I've talked about it a little bit in detail on my my podcast a little bit here um but i'll try to be as hard as going in the future and, and going into these different platforms liquid staking is probably something that you're going to hear me mention a lot and i like the functionality behind it so we got marinade here uh this particular platform again you stake your solana you earn rewards but with staking solana on this platform you get liquid token from liquid staking um, basically instead of you just staking your solana and not being able to do anything with it with these liquid tokens from through staking through the platform and other platforms do have this same component and stuff like that uh, you get these tokens and then from there those tokens you betcha take those on the defy world go play in that particular space and try to capitalize and maximize your gains here so their airdrop season is going to be ending here very soon. As you can see, it ends December 31st. Um, actually, let me go ahead and jump into that a little bit here before I actually kind of dive more into the platform. So as you can see, this is their earn season one. This was a three month campaign, actually. Obviously, I was a little late to the party. We don't have too much time here. So this one, I would say probably should be on your high priority list if you are airdrop farming and all that good stuff here so um there is a, a fixed amount of awards so they have a duration from obviously october 1st to the 31st here unless they get capped out at 40 million mmde the large solana holders keep this in mind can't just you know take out everybody it's a little bit more fair a little bit more uh equal um, as far as particular airdrop goes and as far as what the token does um, it's going to be as you can see set up through a DAO, right so it's gonna be a lot of governance with this token as you can see here it controls the DAO treasury control 20 percent of the salon delegate the validators in the marinate stake pool and then allows you to vote on proposals which if you have staked governance tokens before um Things, tokens I can think of right now off the top of my head because I stake in that ecosystem is Cosmos. Um, obviously, you're able to vote on those all those different proposals that, you know, pop up here and there and stuff like that. Uh, so as you can see, like I said, season one's ending very soon here. And it's pretty easy to earn the reward. So let's kind of go back to that. So let's go back to the main page here. We'll come back to staking. So... As you see, it says right here, I have 105.47 Solana staked. Uh, my APY project is about 8.26, which puts me, as you see, just kind of changed up there uh, at 8.70 Solana that I'm gonna be earning per year if I'm just gonna be staking with this platform, obviously. Now, as you can see right here, my rewards, uh, I'm at 6.527 MEDE. I was thinking that I was gonna be getting 100 per Solana stake, that's 100, right? Because I think that was one of the things they had mentioned in 
I'll show you guys what I'm referring to here pretty soon. Um, my active positions. So we got the insole right there, the marinate steak sole. That's where I'm getting my 8.30% APY. It breaks it down of how that kind of works. Obviously, steak and rewards is where majority of the APY comes from. And then you got the incentives, right? Um, that relieves the, or that's the rest of the APY right there. Now, this geo sole position here, it's saying that I'm staking it. Um, that one's a little bit more confusing. And the reason why I say that is because I'm not necessarily staking um, that particular position. I'm actually, because that's that position I'm borrowing off of margin five. So I'm kind of curious to see how that, I guess, got tied into a staking position. If I'm earning off of it, by all means, great. Um, and then obviously it shows me my Solana that's not earning any yield, that's not being staked. And they do have the native staking program. So the program I'm in is, what was this program called? I want to just say it was the marinade like staking strategy. Um, APY on that one's 8.72%. That's what you get in that particular product. Um, at stake rebalancing, no smart contract exposure or anything like that. And then you get obviously the top 151 best performing validators. So as far as liquidity goes, this right here, man, you see the total volume locked right now currently is at about 5.85 million, which it's not too shabby, right? Um, and again, when it comes to liquidity pools, definitely gotta be careful, always do your own research, stuff like that. But man, seeing this APY, I was like, it's kind of hard not wanting to, you know, just deposit some because I mean, sheesh, man, 96%. That's not too shabby on Solana. I, huh? So again, that's why I said, Liquid staking seems like it has opened up some other doors. And again, I've been in the DeFi world before, dabbled with it, especially on Solon, uh, Radium, Orca. Those are kind of like my introductory platforms. It's been a while since I actually got back into the swing of things, but obviously with these airdrops happening, of course it's got my, my uh, attention right. So again, if you do decide to provide some liquidity here, that's the APY you're looking at. So. Again, I might, I might tap in with that and just test the wires to see what type of return I'm going to get, obviously. Um, and then you come here to the earn. So again, as you see right there, it says 100 MEDE per 100 Solana stake, right? So I'm thinking I'm going to be getting 100 MEDE rewards for my 100 Solana that I've stake. But, you know, it is what it is, whatever. Woo, woo, woo. Um, Pro program again i'll be dropping my link here in the description so if you guys want to help out to help get the rewards by all means use that link down there um and as you can see right here so and if you have any other little faqs uh the website has the answers to them but again just wanted to get kind of like i said a quick overview video of this particular platform um like i said it's gonna be another platform that's obviously in the rotation as far as uh, Solana airdrops go, stuff like that. So, um, again, same thing with this one. If you guys want, might make a more in-depth video as far as, I guess, maybe how all the different features work. Go a little bit into liquid staking a little bit here. Um, and maybe kind of, you know, answer any of the questions that you guys might have. But, like I said, for this particular platform, it's pretty simple, pretty easy. Um, and then, like I said, you get that, those MSOL tokens that you can go use in the DeFi world, which I'm doing. So that, I would say, was going to just wrap it up for this, like I said, this particular platform, this particular video, uh, I should say as well, um, as far as Marinade goes. But again, you will, you'll hear me talk about Marinade going in the future here. Again, obviously, once 12 days hits, it's going to be like Christmas, right? <laughs> We're going to open up that present and see how many tokens that's going to be possibly dropping in our in our wallet and then if i'm not mistaken i think mnde just got listed on kucoin i think today or i think it was today or something like that um so it's going to be interesting to see you know where the value is it's going to be for these particular tokens but um yeah that's it 
I'm your host. Before I let you guys go, if you guys did enjoy the video, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new to the channel. And then also hit that hit that bell be notified for future videos um, so you guys don't miss out on any content that's coming from the channel. And then also subscribe to my other channels as well as far as like my Instagram, TikTok, uh, my podcast because I do tend to drop, you know, content throughout all those different outlets as far as when the times they come in, you know, you just got to kind of uh, stay up to date. But I've tried to, you know, especially as of recently, try to put some weekly content out there. Um, because again, there's a lot that's going on in this particular space. So, um, yeah, so that's gonna wrap it up here, folks. I guess say all the time, not your keys, not your wallet. Um, stay safe out there. Again, when you're watching these videos, this is the, my opinion. I'm not a financial advisor by all by all means. So always do your own research, because uh, you guys know crypto space is like the wild wild west. <laughs> uh, but that's it, y'all. Take it easy. Peace.